Keke. What is up, peeps? This is Sonic Gundam 2, and welcome to another of my Sonic Gundam 2 76th official watch play, which is going to be Wild Woody for the Sicker CD. And just to let you know, guys, that this is going to be my first ever doing a, a Sicker CD LP. Yes, folks, this is going to be my first time doing a Sicker CD LP. And. Just. And I think I... Oops. Reason. <laughs> so yes, the reason I'm doing this... This Wild Woody LP because... There's nobody out there doing a first Wild Woody LP. Yeah, I know, that's crazy. Nobody's doing a Wild Woody LP whatsoever. I only checked some videos on YouTube saying that there's not a single LP of Wild Woody. But, luckily, th this is going to be the first ever Wild Woody LP that I'm ever going to be doing it for myself. So, so, so yes, this is what Wild Woody the Sicker CD looks like. And just to let you know that Wild, that, um, Wild Woody is now officially for the mutant. So, if you want to go and check that, that out for Wild Woody mutant, then be sure to check it out. But what right now we got a cutscene? Radio Jackson. Radio just keeps getting weird for no reasons. I gotta say this. Yeah, I'm so excited to do this first ever sick of CD LP. Let's be honest with you. Looks like something's happening to that wet glass thing. And it looks like it's just a statue piece that's half scattered through different ways. Yeah, it's been scattered through all different dimensions. Whoa. And we're in space. <laughs> I take him back. Looks like those jerks are in space. Again. <laughs> now I gotta find me some muscle to bring him back. Hmm, not much to work with here. Say, now that one's got potential. Wake up, pal. You and me got work to do. Here comes Wild Woody. <laughs> Wild Woody got some potential stuff going on. <laughs> He's going crazy over that set. You got a name, Leadhead? Call me Woody. Wild Woody. Tell me, I know my name, but it seems that's all I know. Wait, let me explain. I'm Lowman of the Totem Pole. My fat head totem brothers have escaped my control, and I brought you to life to go and round them up. If you don't get them back, they'll wipe out everything. So, what do you think? Think you can save the world? My good man, as of 15 seconds ago, I was burned to save the world. Where do I start? Sure is. <laughs> what is that pirate book? Jump in after him and look for sketches in there. Any sketch you draw will come to life. Now go! See you, Jeff. Oh boy, it's time to start sketching. <laughs> yeah! It's <Yahoo! laughs> just crazy and jumps through that <laughs> fucking picture of a pirate ship. And just like that, we are now entering the gameplay. First level, which is roadside battle. Uh, here's all the controls you press D, I mean, press C to jump. Up is to look up, down is to look down, and A doesn't do. I don't think A can do anything at this point. Uh, 
And I, I set it on easy difficulty because if I set it on a normal or the, or the harder difficulty, the boss battles would be getting sometimes pretty much tough. So therefore I set it on to easy mode so therefore I don't get taken damage as usual. But, and just to let you know, I used to do the uh, first ever of the oldest six sick a CD of me, and that is Sonic Mega Mix. But unfortunately, I had to cancel that Sonic Mega Mix LP and decide to do this this Bald Woody LP for my first ever Sega CD. Like, uh. Yeah, the game will be going much harder later on, folks. Trust me, you don't want to fuck around. By the way, you have to, like, uh, collect one of these notepads in, in order to sketch something to life, like, for example, when I first started going to a sketchbook, and you get these all kinds of books, a page notes that you will sketch them to life in some sort. It's got some crazy powers and stuffs. Got hit by a dagger. Ow, fucker. You don't want to fuck with the pirates. Ow! Alright, let's save state. Cause, why not? I will be save stating through this a lot, cause this level... I mean, it, this game is pretty much difficult. And if you've seen the arrows thing signed, that means that there's a checkpoint. Huh. And if you collect the hard pieces, that means it, it can give you some extra health. And why do I do that? By the way, if you've seen some like the uh, unbalanced that needs a raising. It is simply like a walk forwards and just erase it. One of the part stuffs. It's just hard as balls. There's, there's no telling explanations whatsoever that there. Fucker. Uh, load. Guys, I don't want to take that beating of a damage. Pirate. What a fuck you. What a shit. This pencil maniac doesn't even give a shit. Ow, oh, and I got hit by a fucking cannonball. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Fucker. Save. I'm thinking I'm getting taking damage way too much. Just stuck down. Ow! T took a dagger to the face. Ow! So sometimes it's kind of like uh, awkward with the with the wrapping rope segments. It's kind of like awkward, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Ow! Like, this, this level can be pretty much like a long maze. I mean, just to give you a spoiler alert, there are five levels in this game. Just a spoiler alert, I think. Because I know, I just like test plays before to see what the game looks like. Ow. Took a sword to the face. Exit. Uh, we just got past the first segment of this level. <sighs> and now we're going to the cave. Yeah, too particular. And luckily, it just refills your health. So that's kind of a good thing to hear. Uh, Safety is F5. 
and load and set fate. Got it. I sometimes I need to like just need to remember where everything is, so therefore I know. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. Just took a spike to the face. Out. Just took the pirate skulls. And just let you know that I will be doing one video per level as usual. Because some of the levels are getting are, are really, really, really long as balls. Just to let you know. Yeah, because some of the levels are pretty much long as balls. Like, uh. Yeah, that thing that you just saw right there, I just like erased the, the thing. Like the chest opens. If there's some, like, a. Like a wall that needs to be erased, just. Just like, uh. Erase the walls and stuff. Am I not a fucking pirate? F fuck you! Fuck your asshole! God damn it! <sighs> pirate sins. What would expect? Pirates are always a villains. Pirates are always bad! Get an extra health. Hurry up, buddy. Otherwise, you're gonna get spiked. And I just walked into it. <laughs> Fuck. Ow. <laughs> Fucking mutator clam. And by the way, just let you know if you're sketching some stuff, your body will decrease. Like, uh, if you try to sketch something, your body will become smaller and smaller and smaller every time you sketch it. And and once you use the, the sketch for the third time, then you become smaller and you won't have to sketch ever again. And just like that, we are now approaching the first boss. And save. And it's the fucking skeleton, dude. Ow. This is gonna be pretty, pretty much a pain in the ass. Sketch uh, into a kite, see if that does anything. Oh, I got a health. Nice, I need that. He's trying to take care of this fucking bastard as possible. Hard. Being able to take down the first boss. Phew. You made it back. It's only 13 minutes. 13 minutes and 12 seconds. Damn, that was pretty much fast for first level. But still, I'm gonna be doing a video per level. Yeah. All right, my creative juices are flowing now. Who's next? Brimstone. He blasts him into that picture. It used to be a Greek maid. Now you're looking at Olympus, home of the gods. Star. Take your cup enough to battle the god, Jean Swan. They won't know what it is. And now it's the second level, which is the. Olympus. But, but since that we beat that first level, I'm just gonna have to save state it. And I'm gonna have to end this part one here. Anyways, this is Sonic Lim 2 doing this part one of Wild Woody for the Sicker CD. Now so see us all later on part two, where we continue and take on and explore the second level, which is the Olympus world. Or the myth and mythology world or whatever. So anyways, this is Sonic 2 signing out.